السلام علیکم ایوری ون ویلکم بیک ٹو مائی یوٹیوب چینل مٹاسٹک ڈیز وی آر بیک ٹو ایئرز لیٹر وتھ اے ویڈیو آئی نو اٹس بن اے وائل بٹ آئی ایم ایکسائٹیڈ ٹو کائنڈ آف گیٹ بیک آن کیمپس اینڈ گیٹ تھنگس گوئنگ اگین سو کیپ واچنگ utilize the anatomy lab it's there for you guys um if you want to raise your grades or klm first do that then go through the rs that's really good and then go through mcqs what's your question oh they're left behind <laughs> we left them behind okay 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 i'm now What advice would you give to first years preparing for their exams right now? Don't procrastinate. <laughs> okay. That's 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 all. But I what's like what like some prep leave tips? Um uh, use mnemonics. Study okay. together, study with a group. Yes, 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 yes. And and, and it shouldn't be like six people. It should be like three people max that you yeah, study with. Yeah, just do it like in a little group so you can understand and stuff. And Like, what else? What else is there? Maya. <laughs> okay, what advice would you give to people or students preparing for their first year exams right now? Like prep leave tips. Uh, first year. So, focus on the main stuff. Don't try to like memorize. What is the main stuff? <laughs> the main stuff, whatever like your teachers taught, follow your study guide. Okay? And don't like try to do as many sections as you can. Yeah, past papers yeah, are very important. Past papers are really important. So, so by study guide, do you mean like the lecture outlines? Yeah, the lecture objectives are very important. Right. I mean, like I know some people that use them and some people that don't. Like it's a personal preference. Um, but basically, you'll be most likely tested. Tested. Organize you. Yeah. Organize your study as well. Yeah, you'll most likely be tested on what's given in your lectures. So if you've made anti cards throughout the year, stuff like that really helps. or even just looking back at your past papers because you probably won't see stuff outside your lectures so yeah. i guess that could be an advantage yeah practicing from that will actually build your concept and it will clear your concept like right. okay what are some you know like some people have exam anxiety what tips would you give for that anxiety um, yeah take a break honestly for like 5 to 10 minutes listen to some music and Right. Yeah, I think it's uh, important to use good stress relieving. I don't know. Do you have hobbies? Do you have hobbies, Mariam? Uh yeah. Listening to music, going out and yeah, that's my thing. Yeah, it's really loud here. I have never been to this side of Seville. I'm going first time. I think like what helps is just kind of keeping in mind that um at the end of the day you've done your studying exactly. and you'll get through it. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So, 
we should really look at the bone models. Right? Oh, <laughs> the bone models. <laughs> I'll bring the thing on. The bone models because uh, that will help you visualize. Uh, yeah. So that's one thing for anatomy. What do you think was like the biggest struggle doing locomotor module? What was the hardest part about it? Since there were like a lot of muscles, right? So to memorize them, obviously, and to know where the origin and insertion is, that's like the hardest part. So yeah. if you have like a if you have like a bone model or something, then you can label it and look at it or something. So it will help you visualize better. Yeah, true. Okay, so do you think it's important to know origins and insertions? Because a lot of students ask that question. It's honestly not, but just know like where like main muscles are attached, like in what's it called in your shoulder. Like you have some important muscles, just know where it's attached, like pectoralis muscle. That's like an important muscle, like you usually get asked origin and insertion for that. But other than that, most muscles they don't ask, like hand muscles. We did hand muscles, but like it wasn't asked for. Neither yeah. origin nor insertion, like we just have to know them, like yes. what they are. Just know them, but you don't have to memorize like specific details for them. True. Okay, over to <laughs> Javeria. Okay, yeah, I guess adding on to that, what we did in first year, was because um, we studied during COVID, so we didn't have a lot of like face to face lectures, we were all learning online, right? So, when uni did open, what we did as a group, right? We all picked like a bone, for example, and you become an expert on it, okay? You learn everything like um, anatomic position, line markings, um, muscle attachments, so what the muscles do. And all we did was we went to uni, we took those bones from the bone mat, and we sat in a circle, and everyone taught their bone to each other and then everyone would like hold it and so you can basically understand and feel because anatomy just doing it from a book is too hard like you're not going to understand like having a physical was really helpful for us and just helps you remember and even in bibles i think they can often just hand you a bone and be like okay start talking about it uh, we made videos of that yeah as well. we made videos yeah. yeah we recorded it and then like sent it in our yes. chat so you could like refer to it yeah. later on yeah so that's what we did. And okay. Us. What about you, Hamna? Well, basically, they just said everything. <laughs> <laughs> I was going. I was thinking about, but like, just especially using an atlas while you study anatomy is very important because, uh, like, visualizing the things is very, very necessary. <laughs> and just like memorize, make memorizing easy for yourself. Using you know, mnemonics, use whatever makes you like. Use little tips and tricks wherever you can to remember everything. And yeah, that's basically it. And the anatomy expert. Okay. <laughs> no, <laughs> we know <laughs> anatomy. Okay. Um, so first off, you guys have to use all the models in the anatomy lab. Um, they're all for you guys. Like once you do a topic from KLM or from uh, from Grace, pick up BRS and then go to your anatomy lab and like just take that model and do the whole thing again. Just yeah. like explain everything all over again and really try to understand where it is. And then also for me, what I used to do is that like when I when I read KLM, I used to read KLM. So in that, like I wouldn't leave any sentence. If it doesn't make any sense, like search it up and like see what it means. And I would make models like with color pencils and stuff to try to like make it more, you know, real for me. I'm not like her at all. She put in a lot of effort. She yeah. does. She puts in so much effort into it's, anatomy. You should see her notes. It's why she's so good. Yeah. yeah. No, like she's you're putting like effort in. Oh my really Stop it. Stop. She's, she's <laughs> being modest. Stop, Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> no, but that, those are all really good tips. Okay, so what textbooks did you guys use? In first year, first year I used KLM, but I do think Grace was better. Yeah, first year it was I either KLM or Grace, really like depending on the topic. I understand Grace more. I used to like Grace better, but now I like KLM better. Yeah, I like KLM I don't know. all the way. I'm really? I switched. I, I used Grace. KLM in first year and I switched Grace. in second year. Yeah, I used I've Grace always used year. KLM. Really? Yeah. Yeah. KLM, man, it's just Talked really wordy. It's yeah. really it's detailed, detailed yeah. filled, but some people like that more. Right. Yeah. It helps you remember. But it's hard. I like it more. Reading first year, it was complicated, right? Yeah. First year, Anyone read like BD Charusia? Yeah. Yeah. Anyone read BD Charusia? No. 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 <laughs> but BRS is really good for BRS is really, really, good. really good. Yeah. And the questions yeah. are really good too. BRS Anatomy. And I think like yeah. another good Appleton. question Cersei, is Appleton. Appleton mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Really okay. So well, the way I study is not very, it's kind of different. I like to use the website Instant Anatomy Zen yeah. because I'm obsessed yeah. with that. And I used to All just take time. those diagrams and put them into Anki and like use the image and occlusion tool mm -hmm. to kind of remember different parts. And then with her to the anatomy lab, she would kind of teach me and walk me through the models and I would help like identify it. Once she would teach me something, I would try to like summarize what she taught me so that I knew that I was understanding it. 
So it's not just listening, but it's also kind of like recalling that information. That's actually, yeah, that's yeah. interactive. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. 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 Cool. And so doing questions, I feel like alone is really, really boring, even mm -hmm. if it's MCQ. No, it's, so it's impossible to remember. Doing yeah. it alone yeah. is really yeah. hard. When we do it together, we're I guess more both active, and there's like two brains and working then, like, at the same the time. Yeah. The other, just <laughs> <laughs> that is true. So, what are some tips for vivas? Because they ask a lot of things. What are some things that they ask very commonly? I know the brachial plexus injuries. You have yeah. to know them by heart. Well, it depends well, on which all module. Is. Yeah, honestly, yeah. for local, all the like nerve injuries, yeah. especially they're very important. Yeah. All of, like the hand, job yeah. hand, or yeah. whatever they were called. Those were very important. We'll make it like um, module wise, like for the vibes. Yeah. yeah. And then obviously past papers, right? The past vibes. Yes. Yeah. They're really True. important. True. So I think we've got three main tips. Um, spend time with anatomy. Two, use your question resources effectively. And three, study with friends. Mm -hmm. I think those are the three main tips to keep in mind for anatomy. And never forget the models. Never. Yes. 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 You yeah. always yeah. need to look at models. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> Thank you guys.